Good morning. Good to share with you today. Uh, this is from Joshua chapter 22, verse 5. It says, but be careful to obey all the commands and the instructions that Moses gave to you. Love the Lord your God. Walk in all his ways. Obey his commands. Hold firmly to him. And serve him with all your heart and all your soul. You know, this passage comes from Joshua, chapter 22, toward the end of Joshua's life. The tribes of Israel, they've been given their allotments of land, and Joshua's giving some last-minute instructions to those followers of the Lord, and he says, here you go. Um, pretty simple, pretty straightforward, is what he says. Now, I think at times we can kind of make following the Lord sound pretty complicated. Um, we often want to add on extra things, which seem to make sense to us, but they're not necessarily included in what God has to say. And we really shouldn't be adding to what God has to say about what it takes to follow him. And um, these verses list some simple requirements. Love the Lord. Walk in all his ways. Obey his commands. Hold firmly to him. Serve him with all your heart and soul. They sound very similar to something that Jesus said in Matthew chapter 22, verses 37 through 39. When he was asked, what's the most important commandment? Jesus didn't hesitate. He said, the most important commandment is... You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind. This is the great and first commandment. And the second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. Not complicated. Not necessarily easy, but not complicated. Love God with all your heart, soul, mind, and strength. Love Jesus. Love others. Not complicated. Not easy. But definitely not complicated. Let's pray. God, we lift our hearts to you today. Lord Jesus, we love you. and We desire to show our love to you by walking in all your ways, by following your commands. Not picking and choosing what we think we ought to follow, but just taking you at your word and following you. And Lord, as an extension of our love for you, we want to love those whom you love. We want to love others. And I pray, God, today that you'd help us to find new ways in which we can show that love for you and that love for others. And we pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Thanks, friends. We'll see you tomorrow.